looking for something to do on a summer night, head down to South Kingstown or Newport to watch some top-notch talent in the New England Collegiate Baseball League. The Waves are ranked number one in the country, and tonight they hosted the Gulls. Our Ruthie Polinski was there and has more on both teams and any sort of Ocean State rivalry. Two Rhode Island teams going head to head tonight here at Old Mountain Field. The Newport Goals sitting in last place in the South Division. The Ocean State Waves sitting in first place, but still the rivalry lives on, especially with many of these guys originally from right here in Rhode Island. Some of these guys, though, not so much. I'm from Loganville, Georgia, Atherton, California. Poplar Bluff, Missouri. I've never been to Rhode Island in my life. When you do get a sunny day, you can't beat it. Uh, we've had rain here and there, but for the most part, most part, I've loved the East Coast and I'm um, playing for the goals. We definitely have some characters on the team, especially the Rhode Islanders. Oh, yeah, we, we've had some players, you know, from the, the Midwest that they've never seen water before other than out of their sink, you know. For some, they are playing in their home state. And for locals Matt Murphy and Chris Wright, they're enjoying that too. It's for them to be able to come down and watch all the home games and uh, maybe get some home cooking every now and again. That's always nice. I played on both sides, so I played for Ocean State and um, I'm playing in Newport this summer and um, just coming over the bridge and uh, being so close, it definitely makes for a little rivalry. For us, you know, of course we want to beat each other, and uh, but it's not like we hate each other, like some rivalries, right? The Ocean State Waves have taken three of their last four meetings against the Newport Goals. The Goals, of course, looking to bounce back tonight. In South Kingstown, I'm Ruthie Polinski, Eyewitness Sports. Thank you, Ruthie. Upset City.